Eh watu wangu mko vipi? Now this is one of the cases ambazo ziliweza kuchezo chini ya maji sana na these two people baada ya wao wawili kutengana. Wahuwa Makdi pamoja na Makdi. Tiaide Muire. We all knew these people. Makdi DJ Makdi na mkewe wa Huwa Makdi. These people were inseparable bana. The love they shared, the bond they shared was so so lively it was it was so lively on facebook and on their social media platforms everybody was on their case so now people loved them how they shared their love story to the public and everybody was like you know what if i want to be, if i get married i want to have a husband who cares for me like Magdi does for Wahu, who posts me every time who is always every minute confessing his love for me like Wahu da, like 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 DJ Magdi does to Wahu hey ha damu irane ko anyita nira kidogo kutoka mwaka mwezi mwaka ulopita mwezi disemba kitumbua kiliingia mchanga Penzi la Makdi pamoja na Wahu lilipata kuingia mchanga na wawili yao wakafikia kutengana. Ila wawili yao hawajaweza kuconfess kwamba waliachana aswa katika mitandao ya kijamii because everybody has been quiet. But mother moi hakihiga eh niere leo mudhi kudhadhaura kire ya kirahanika katika Makdi na Wahu wake. Na try with Daniel. Eh najua wale ambao mnaelewa Kiswahili bado mnaelewa Kikuyu. So itabidi ni flow na na, na lugha ya ki, Kiswahili. So what has been happening? Makdi amerudi kuwa blogger. E, ni mrono ya Makdi areka kilimita dawa yake na nenda ni shio kinyaniria. Mnaona chenye ambacho anakifanya mle. Wa hu wa Makdi alikwenda mpaka akabadili jina lake ambalo alikuwa anaitwa Wahu wa Makdi asoa katika mtandao wake wa kijamii wa Facebook na kuweza kujiita Wahu wa Kariuki. Hmm? Tunaelewana mpaka hapo. So unataka tusome hii post ya Mother Moya Kihinga todo. Mother Moya Kihinga aliweza kuachia history hii leo na aliachia na design yake ambayo nao adiza amekuwa nayo. Mm. <laughs> mm. Ah, uh, alikuwa na design yake ambayo alikuwa anakuja nayo. Tiga demo ile. Anasema you know now this she's selling a lot of content I expose around at na roya. Ona idu to tire na roya ne kwaria toraria. Now mother moi haki hinga the city of Amoneville the hair waves hum with the magnetic energy of DJ Max and radio presenter Stella their love story seemed straight out of a fairy tale with whispers of romance floating through the streets their joint shows were legendary blending Max's beat with Stella's silky voice to create an intoxicating harmony that enchanted listeners far and wide But behind the scenes, rifts began to form in their seemingly perfect union. Max, with his easygoing nature, found himself increasingly frustrated by Stella's stubbornness and manipulative tendencies. The once vibrant partnership began to strain under the weight of unspoken tensions and and Indian agendas. As rumors swelled about the true nature of their relationship, listeners and fans alike wondered what had happened to their dynamic duo. Some speculated about creative differences while others whispered about secrets and betrayals. In the head, Max made the difficult decision to walk away, choosing to prioritize his own mental health and emotional well-being over the allure of fame and success it was a bitter sweet ending to a love story that had captured the hearts of many but amid it the wreckage of their failed marriage a valuable lesson emerged sometimes love isn't enough to sustain a relationship in a world where appearances can be deceiving and emotions run deep it's essential to recognize the signs 
of manipulation and toxicity and have the courage to walk away before it's too late. Oshio, ne mada moya kihiga yeke logo. Ma, mada wito. Ah, Marisa, unatua na kizungu we. Unatu Marisa na kizungu. Hmm, hmm. Mnani ski ya lakini. Yeah, that is mother muhi haki hinga for you. Na even diva mbavo alikuwa nasema kusiana na hii. Story ya Mark D. Pamoja na. Uh, uh, and uh, uh, wahu, wahu changed account. Wahu. Wahu waka revi. Not wahu wa Mark D. Now it is. Ase jiriri yetu wagitu ikamo. Wahu waka revi. E shishio uwakia. Eh hey, agashita ga madira finest kabinti karembo kamali fine kini unajua ni amda tu ni amda sasa tukiugea ati adoito tukiugea ati hivi si tutasema tu ni amda maana you know what love sometimes ni stories flani hivi ambazo mnaweza jaribu kuzielewa kabisa lakini mshindo mapenzi Mapenzi ni kitu fulani kina kina ki, ki, kina ki, kitu fulani ukijaribu kuyaelewa ndivyo yanakushinda kabisa. Mm? So you do naelewana lakini. Eh, hey, Magdina eh maisha ya mwe, yanamwendea vizuri, unajua? Magdi alichagua mental health. But it seems in regards to Marida, in regards to what our Marida is telling us, ni kwamba eh uh, Uh, you know what in regards to Marida na Manisha na Nindi alikuwa na shida wahu mm? eh ni mroni the other day Macdi aliweza kujizawadi gari lake jipya mm? eh hey, na Macdi is driving kwanza kadamu yake ya DJ inafanya fiti sana and we love him for what he has always done This is a guy that lives life man and he is always out there chasing the bag. Moki uge mote ka uge. Mseme msiseme. Macdi will always be chasing the bag. And he chose his mental health as we are being told. Those are the type of men we like and we love and we will support. Atoko wa data mono mwana wito. Itakoma kani akire ya do mara iga na da inishio kinyaniria. Na ogwo try gana to diete na bere ogwo. Ni gamuriri kani ya geke e, e, e no ni FM show KE mm? e, e no ni FM show KE Doka ime utasubscribe ite mm? Subscribe Tungane katika video zetu zijazo